It's been over three years now since Netflix came out with an entirely new category on their streaming service, and that is games. There's many times where I ask people if they actually know there's games on their Netflix account. And they're like, oh, really? I, th I thought only movies and shows. But it is severely underrated, and it has been an ongoing ambition on Netflix's part to bring in gaming into the forefront of their service. And uh, I'll be honest, if you look at perceived value for what you pay on a Netflix subscription, what you get besides, you know, movies and shows is the large foray, the massive catalog of games that are on Netflix. Now, bear in mind, they're not all masterpieces, but uh, if you're somebody who likes playing mobile games, anything arcadey, something to pass the time, there's a few there's a few hits there that might actually interest you. And um, they've recently laid out an ambitious strategy uh, into uh, basically developing more games into their platform. They've revealed that there are over 80 games currently in development uh, with plans to release at least a new game per month through the Netflix Stories app. That's quite ambitious, actually especially at a time where Netflix has established some exclusive franchises of their own, some are award-winning, to expand on that besides just having a new season or a sequel for a movie, you can also tie that with games. And uh, I find that pretty smart. There is definitely an interest from Netflix, and uh, the co-CEO and president Craig Peters explains that the company's involvement in gaming is driven by financial goals. He sees, he highlights that the global gaming market, excluding Russia and China, generates over $150 billion in annual revenue, even without considering ad revenue. And so one thing that there's, uh, there's also a distinction here is that Netflix games don't have microtransactions and ads especially when other mobile games out there whichever you download into your phone usually have ads and all these little paywalls but uh, Peter has hinted that ad based games could be a possibility in the future stating that ad revenue for games is not part of the current Netflix model but not ruling it out either maybe in the future when they want to you know increase their earnings don't be surprised if you start seeing ad based games on netflix as well starting in july netflix plans to launch about one new game title per month in the netflix stories hub featuring popular ips like emily in paris and selling sunsets with more diverse games coming in the future the Netflix co-CEO co Ted Sarandos expressed excitement about games as they provide a unique opportunity to engage fans between seasons of a show, which is pretty smart, filling in that gap. He teased the potential for Netflix games to introduce new characters and storylines that could influence future seasons or movie sequels. Wow. And what's also interesting is that they do have a few AAA games and development and those are the ones that i'm really keeping a clo close eye on because that that means you know there's high budgeted games in development from netflix and so it makes me wonder at what point can netflix compete with the likes of other game live uh, live subscription services such as the likes of xbox game pass or the playstation plus Hmm, who knows? Only time will tell. But uh, quite ambitious from Netflix. I think of all the other live streaming services, they're probably the only one that is tapping into gaming at such a level currently. And uh, it's interesting to see where this will go in the near future. But you guys let me know. Text me your thoughts. Let me know your opinions. And uh, yeah, all we can do is really wait and see. And with that, guys, it's time to wrap it up here on the Evening Buzz. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I'll see you guys on the next one right here every Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday from 8 till 9 p.m. live right here only on Pulse 95 Radio.
This is Mikel Atia signing out. Have a good one. If you liked this episode of The Evening Buzz, go, go, go. drop a like and subscribe. Be sure to follow us on Instagram for all our daily updates and top stories. Oh, awesome.